two people multitasking. Okay, I have no rights activist and you put all of this together is exciting to finally see your hard work paid off tonight? yes this is actually our second fundraising and um, I'm very proud to be here at uh, dr. Babak uh, home uh, he's uh, dedicated his house for this uh, second fundraising we have it is a very important fundraising because we are creating the dialogue with the Orange County public um, to make sure that they understand what is Persian Parade about how extensive it is and how far we're gonna go with this journey to together uh, as Iranian and expatriates and particularly for our children in the future and now that uh, they have this self of uh, self identity within the beautiful floats that is going to be created and the whole wonderful vibrant um, um, large parade which almost I would say 25 floats is going to be there with dance groups and uh, with the Los Angeles Police Department behind it and it would be expanding into Orange County and all the other major cities in the United States and in the world. We're here in Newport Beach, California. I'm Charlotte Broadbent for Samira's show, and we're here tonight for a charity auction event. This is for the Persian Parade, and usually it's in New York, but this is to make it in Los Angeles. Are you excited to be here tonight, and yes, what I is am. it that you do? Yes, I am. Uh, actually, tonight we are here at the uh, Persian Parade uh, uh, charity auction, and uh, Miss Mary Opic has gone through the, a lot of tr trouble and hard work to put this together, and we have also Mayor uh, Delshad here and many other celebrities. What is it that you're doing tonight here? Are you excited to be here? Yeah, it's so exciting. I want to thank Mary Epic for inviting us and Zara um, who put this event together. It's been really wonderful. And of course, my friend Vida Kafari. It's really, really nice. It's uh, in, a, in a beautiful house down in Newport Beach. It's a um, charity event for the Persian Parade. Persian Parade is going to be in April next year. They're going to put on an event uh, which is big. It's going to be something like the Rose Parade. So I would completely, um, you know, want all the Persians to get together and help out and do as much charity as they could and help out Maria Pig and all that they did together and Jimmy Delshaw the mayor of Beverly Hills the previous mayor of Beverly Hills is here there's a lot of wonderful uh, people here doctors lawyers and Dr. Bobak put this together it's his house so it's an honor I'm also having my jewelry for the first time the Persian charity so it's really nice so I'm having my jewelry for auction tonight so um, to help out as much as I can. We are here with um, the previous mayor of Beverly Hills Jimmy Delshaw He's really one of my favorite people. I really mean it. And he's oh, also yes. one of the only persons I've had on my show. And it's an honor. And we're here today. You support everybody. Persian, American, the whole town. Everyone loves you. So what are you here for today? I'm here to promote the Persian parade. As you know, there are Persian parades going on in New York for 10 years. And I was honored to be the Grand Marshal of the last parade in New York. And I'm uh, very happy to announce that we're going to have our own Los Angeles Persian Parade in March of 2014. Uh, it's the Samara Show. Samara Show. Okay. Uh, so, Charlotte, um, how often do you come to Persian events? Well, this is my first one with Samara. Um, what are you doing here? Hey, cool. Are you excited for the auction tonight? This? Who is being auctioned? <laughs> what is being auctioned? I think it's jewelry. Jewelry? Oh, uh, by whom? Samara's jewelry is. Oh my gosh, Samara, why, why don't you come here? Your jewelry is being auctioned. So, we have one more person here. 
Oh, coming, coming, coming. So tell us about tell us about your jewelry. Yes. Um, hi, I'm from Samira Show, and this is my jewelry. And my jewelry, I have a TV show that all the celebrities, uh, movie stars, producers come, and they wear my jewelry. And I put it on movies and music videos, television shows, magazine covers, and a lot of um, products that I've been, um, you know, designing it and featuring it. So I'm excited. Very I nice. You in your movie. Very nice. Love Actually, that. is this is this what Charlotte is yes. wearing? Yes. Oh, yes. both of these. Actually featuring it tonight in the auction. Samira's jewelry is going to be in the auction oh, tonight. Oh, the jewelry or Charlotte? Me. Oh, the jewelry. Oh, okay. I, I, I'm, I'm just trying to educate myself. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm learning. I'm learning. Okay, so then basically uh, the jewelry going to be auctioned. Actually, I love the color. The contrast between the jewelry and your skin is beautiful, gorgeous. Okay, so... I'm going to have you as my salesman. You forget your move. I'd like to do a quick uh, introduction of what the Persian Parade is and what is the goal for this event. Um, Persian Parade is going in New York very strongly for the past 10 years. It's one of the most popular Iranian events of New York. It's one of the events that more Iranians gather in New York than any events in the history of Iranian events on the East Coast. It's really powerful and we want to do the same thing in California. Everybody knows in Los Angeles alone we have more Iranians than Tehran itself. خیلی مهمه برای ما ایرانی ها و بودن یک چنین جشنی در نوروز که این جشن نوروزی رو اینترنشنال میکنه یعنی دنیاوی میکنه این خیلی مهمه که هر جای دنیا هر گوشه دنیا نو نوروز رو رسیدن بهار رو جشن بگیره All right we're here in Newport Beach for Samira's show what are you excited about being here? What, what do you do? Oh, I'm very excited about being here. I'm a very good friend of the lovely Mary Apic. She's an amazing actress. She's also a human rights activist. She's very active with the Persian Parade. I think she founded it and she's on the board. And she's just a one woman army. Of you are secure. Since we added, I tell a quick joke, since you said that, you know, this is a, this is a very important saying. Uh, my uncle once told me, he said, there is a difference between finish and complete. Did you know that? There is a huge difference between the word finish and complete. When you marry the right woman, you're complete. When you marry the wrong woman, you're finished. Yes. When the right woman catches you with the wrong woman, you are completely finished. Tonight is the longer than the ingredients in Fessenjun. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome Navid Negahvan in the house. Yes, yeah, yeah, buddy. What are we trying to do tonight? We're trying to steal that uh, finger, uh, whatever she's got on there, <laughs> and sell it at the auction. We're here tonight as a Persian parade fundraiser, and uh, we have all the big names of the Iranian community here tonight. Uh, we're starting right from my right hand side. She's so British that she's turning herself Iranian for this master, event. Thank you, somebody. I'm the master of ceremony for this fundraiser tonight. I'm host. I'm the master of ceremony for this event tonight. I'm hosting. I'm introducing all the big timers in the house, and we're just gonna have a good time and raise money. Well, uh, 
what are, who are you wearing, Max? Oh, thank you very much. I always wear a mad designer's outfit tonight. I'm dressed in Angelina. Oh, he's talking about... He's got Samira's jewelry. Yeah, and Samira... And outfit would be perfect. I agree. Samira's ju- Samira has given me her jewelry to wear and then took it back at the end of the event. <laughs> She does it every time, and I'm tired of being teased. I want to keep it next time. Okay, next.